is a thin section through sporangia. Now, your slide is not going to show all three valves. Your, your slide might show one or two. You know, I had to hunt around that I find a good slide that shows all three. But these are the spores. There you go, if you like 40x power. Uh, they're kind of kidney bean shaped. You can see the nucleus of each spore. That's project number one. All right, project number two, that's the gametophyte, okay? And right here are the antheridia. So the gametophyte is kind of small. These are the antheridia. I think 10x power is peachy on this one. I mean, if you go to 40, you're not going to see much more detail. Each one of these cells becomes a sperm, right? Okay? That's number two. Number three, okay, an LS. What's that? Longitudinal section. Here's that sterile central column, stem. Here's a sporophyll, sporophyll. And here's a sporangium, okay? Got the idea, sporophyll, a leaf that bears a sporangium. Or would that be a microspore or megaspore? Neither. Lycopodium is homosporous. So it's just a sporophyll, sporangia. I'll get to you, Miriam, so don't laugh. Here's a sporangia. And your little dog, too. Okay. <laughs> so here's a sporangia. I think your slides are going to show this. I don't see spores. I see clumpy chromosomes. So you might see some uh, sporocytes undergoing meiosis. Okay? Or maybe not. I don't know. But uh, see the clumps? That's 40x power. That's why it's so dark. Okay, cross-section is number four. Don't worry about bastard tissue. We'll study that, you know, later. Uh, but here are the uh, sporangia. Now, these are the one end spores. Okay? So these are the one end spores uh, inside the sporangia. It's homosporous, so they're just plain spores, you know, nothing. There's a sporophyll, a leaf, you know, that's in cross-section. Here's a sporangia. Here's the spores, okay? That's a cross-section. Now, number five is selaginella. All right, that's a genus you have to know. What are the six parts you gotta label? Now, some of you aren't labeling your drawings. Very hard to grade, I mean, I give you credit for it, but I mean, a label drawing is worth a little bit more, isn't it? Uh, microsporophyll, microsporangium, microspores. Megasporophyll, megasporangium, megaspores. Your slides are going to look kind of like this. You might see two. I had, I had to hunt around, and I finally got one that shows all four, or at least a piece of the fourth one. But there's four megaspores inside a megasporangium, megasporophyll. Okay? So you can see how big these megaspores actually get. It's probably near the middle. All right. So that's the Legionella, a genus and six structures that you have to know. Number six. Oh, I don't know if I did this in lecture. Well, you got to know if the lab. Uh, this is a cross-section through Ecrocetum. I mentioned that the stem was hollow. That's the central canal. That's the molecular canal. These are the carinal canal. They alternate. Molecular, carinal, molecular, carinal, molecular, carinal, molecular. And that's a central canal. So the three types of canals in a cross-section of equicetum stem. Okay, this is LS, longitudinal section. There's the plate-like sporophyll and the finger-like sporangia micro or megaspores. Mm -hmm. Very good. Neither. Why? <laughs> equicetum is homosporous, right? Yeah, if you go to, oh, this is a little blurry. But if, if you see some stringy things on these spores, remember what they're called, elaters, huh? Elaters. All right, this is a CS cross-section. There's the sterile central column or stem, and you'll see the various uh, sporangia uh, with spores. If you go out to the outside, these are the plate-like sporophylls, right? And there's the finger-like sporangia, and inside are the one-inch spores. A lot of one-inch spores there. Look at this is the pictures I took at the Morton Arboretum in uh, early May, and so you can see how the 
the plate-like uh, sporophylls are bending over and the spores are ready to be shed or are shed. Uh, here is the sterile shoot, okay, or the summer shoot, okay, the sterile shoot or summer shoot. So there's no strobilis here, you know, it's sterile. Okay, let's get into the polypodiopita. Number nine, the eusporangiates. Massive sporangia embedded in a leaf. Lots of little tiny spores. I guess I only got one slide. Okay. No. I haven't gotten the other one back from the uh, repair shop yet. I hope this one isn't going. 